Makura basi kebiri yande ya la baba baba. Nekabari yande ya la baba 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 baba. Makabara basi nderebe kuru bose kebiri yande ya baba. Makabara basi kebiri bokuru bose yande ya la baba baba baba. Ye makabara basi nderebe kuru bose kebiri ya kaba baba baba. Makabara basi kebiri yande ya la baba baba. Mahande ya la ba 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 ba
praise the Lord praise the Lord hallelujah Amen. Amen and amen. God bless you. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul. Hallelujah. I will bless the Lord at all times. His praise shall continually be in my mouth. Amen and amen. God bless you all. Welcome to Hour of Groaning. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Hallelujah. God bless you all. Welcome, welcome, Emma D. God bless you. Please continue to share. Auntie Lydia Wafe, God bless you. Share. Mama Jennifer Francis, God bless you. Mama Julia Nanimo, please share. Click the thumbs up. There are only three clicks at the moment. Let's take it up. God bless you. Mama Helen Alokwe, God bless you. Welcome. Mama Teresa Champon, God bless you. Uh, Mama Agnes Kwatin, God bless you. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Lami Kato, God bless you. Please click the thumbs up, share it. Amen. Electronic Evangelism, Mary, Minister Mary Annan, God bless you. Prophetess Anas, God bless you. Welcome. Please share. The numbers are still very low. Please share, 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 share. Hallelujah. And the Lord will bless you. Amen and amen. God bless you. God bless you. It's good to see you all. Hallelujah. Rako Katarebo Sekeyanderebe. Father, we thank you for tonight. We bless you. We honor you. Cover me in the blood of Jesus. Let your word, every word that you 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 want your people to hear tonight. Let it come forth and let it be a blessing in Jesus' mighty name. Amen and amen and amen. We want to thank God for the life of our bishop, our papa, Bishop Francis Sapong, and our mother, the first lady, the trending Reverend Elizabeth Sapong. God bless you, mommy, wherever you are. God bless our current president, uh, Prophet Albert A.J. Tune. Amen. And the entire leadership. And God bless you. Um, as you join us from other churches. God bless you. Welcome, welcome. Thank you for joining us tonight. Juliet Allen, God bless you. Auntie Sheila Cato, God bless you and your household. God bless you. Mama Rita Abonsumensa, bless you. First Lady Juliet Amwakwa, God bless you. God bless everyone. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hallelujah. The numbers are still very low, so please, please click the thumbs up and like it amen and amen amen so we're continuing with joseph amen god is good we thank god for the life of our prophet as well prophet Stephen mensa wherever he is god is also with him amen and he's also here with us in spirit amen amen mama evelyn karamanji god bless you ade and ola god bless you welcome Good evening. God bless you. Um, God bless you all. Samantha, God bless you. Amen and amen. We appreciate all of you. Hallelujah. Because if you didn't, if you didn't click click that link, I'll be here by myself, right? I'll just be speaking to the air. <laughs> amen. So God bless you. Um, yesterday we looked at Joseph, so we're gonna continue with Joseph. Amen. Um, so um trust in the lord amen trust god trust in the lord that was what um i was talking about yesterday and we're going to continue today amen we will continue today amen so yesterday for those of you who want online even if you were online repetition is good 
because it will um, in case you missed out something maybe someone distracted you at home or maybe at work or maybe you're doing something you probably missed out on some of what I said yesterday so yesterday we looked at Genesis um, 37 and um, we looked at um, from the beginning to from verse 1 to 11 and I shared with you that um, Joseph is the 11th son of Jacob. His mother was Rachel. He had 10, bro 10 half brothers and one full brother. One full brother meaning that, you know, Rachel had him and his brother. Amen. Benjamin. Hallelujah. So, so the Bible says that, um, in the process of time, um, um, Jacob made Joseph his, his, um, the son of his old age, a coat of many colors because he loved him very much. Amen. And then the Bible said that his brothers were jealous. Hallelujah. But things were still okay. But then when Joseph started dreaming, he was 17 at the time. He shared his dream with them and he had another dream and then he had the third one. Amen. And he shared it with them. So it got to a place whereby even the father said, are you saying the meaning of this is that all of us, including your mom and I will bow to you? So the Bible said that he hid the word in his heart. Hallelujah. And then what happened was process of time. During the process of time, is that the 10 brothers went to um, pasture the father's flock and they hadn't returned. So the father was concerned. And then he said to Joseph, go and find out what's happening with your brothers. He went and even when he got there, he couldn't find them. He met a man that showed him where his brothers were. And then he met them. It's so we called Dalton. Amen. So as he went there and the brothers saw him from afar, they said, oh, here comes the dreamer. Let's kill him and we'll see what will become of his dream. And I was saying yesterday that you can see the conspiracy. They conspired against him. Hallelujah. But then the Bible said that God raised a destiny helper for Joseph. And that destiny helper was his older brother, Reuben. Reuben said, no, we won't shed no blood. We will cast him in the pit. There's no water in the, in, in the pit where they were going to cast him into. Amen. And yesterday we prayed, um, we prayed that, you know, God, anywhere they've gathered for your sake, that God will deliver you and your household and that God will also bring a destiny helper. That was where we stopped. Amen. And then when you look at the Bible, the, 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 the chapter 38 just talks about, um, it talks about um, Judah um, and then verse, and then chapter 39 then talks about the fact that when the brothers um, sold Joseph, they sold him to um, the Ishmaelites and the Ishmaelites then sold Joseph as a slave to Potiphar. Potiphar was a guard, you know, he, he, he was very rich. And then the Bible said that God was with Joseph. Hallelujah. God was with Joseph. That's what we're going to look at today. So from the pit to Mr. Potiphar's house. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Malako se ke yandere bebebe. So when you look at um when when you look at from chapter 39 from verse 1 it says that now Joseph had been taken down to Egypt and Potiphar an Egyptian officer of Pharaoh he worked for Pharaoh the captain of the royal guard bought him from the Ishmaelites who had taken him down there. Amen. And then the verse 2 says that the Lord was, was with um, Joseph. Amen. Through him, hallelujah, even though a slave, he became successful and a prosperous man and he was in the house of his master, the Egyptian. And then the Bible said in verse 3 that his master saw that the Lord was with him and that God had caused all that he did to prosper. He succeeded. Amen. Everything he laid, he laid his hand was a success. And then the Bible said that that Joseph pleased, pleased his master. Amen. Potiphar. And then Potiphar, and, and then he says that he found favor 
amen, before his master, and his master made him a personal servant, hallelujah, and then made Joseph uh, as an overseer over his house, everything that he owned, hallelujah, he gave Joseph, he put Joseph in charge, hallelujah, and because he put Joseph in, in charge, the Bible says that, it says that, you know, the, 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 the Egyptian's house became very rich, he was, he was rich, hallelujah, because of that favor and because God was with Joseph. Amen. And a time came when um, the master was not in the house. Hallelujah. And Mrs. Potiphar um, lusted over Joseph and said, come sleep with me, lie with me. And Joseph said, how can I do this? How can I do this? He said, my, my, my master has given me everything. He's put me in charge over everything except you. Amen. So he said, how can I do this? How can I do this? Amen. How can I do this wicked act? How can I commit this wicked act? And then the Bible said that as the master was away, um, the, 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 the wife went and, you know, he put pressure on Joseph. He still wanted to lie with him. And um, Joseph fled. He left his um apparel his robe and then uh, mrs potiphar took it and then she screamed oh everybody come and see this hebrew boy oh oh this is what he's done to me blah 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 and when you when you look at this you can see that and then she raised her voice and then she cried out and then she screamed and then and then she said see she even left his he left his robe see you see you see what he's done and and then the bible said that that you know this this actually made the master to be angry hallelujah so before we look at verse 19 of Genesis 39, if you've just met, if you've just joined, amen, if you've just joined us, hallelujah. I, I debriefed, I gave a summary of what I said yesterday and tonight, last night, tonight we're looking at um, chapter 39. Yesterday we looked at chapter 37, amen. And this brings me to say that sometimes, you know, when things happen to us, it's for a reason. I know, I mean, we all know that God, you know, the Bible sometimes wouldn't make sense to us in some of the things that happened. However, the way it is, let's take it, you know, literally the way it, it happened. And I believe that when you went to Potiphar's house, because God was with him, God granted him favor and everything that he touched, he succeeded. He was prosperous and the master could tell that the hand of God was upon Joseph. Hallelujah. So first we looked at how God touched the heart of Re Reuben. So, so, so they could not kill him because his brother said, Hey, here comes the dreamer. Let's kill him. So Joseph's problem within household witches and wizards and manipulators and and household enemies started because he had a dream and he shared the dream with them and the dream showed that in the end that he ruled over them amen um i mean everything was okay and that's how it is if you want to bring it to now if you want to bring it to our days when you are amongst certain people everything is okay until they begin to see some changes until they see that oh my gosh this person is now moving to another level or this family is now moving to another level let's see what's going to happen to them and their children oh something will happen maybe one of their children will go to prison maybe one of them or maybe some of the kids will go wayward or maybe something will happen to the mother or the father or maybe something hallelujah and this is how it happens if we want to if we want to be real these are the things that happens and i just want us to learn from this tonight amen and then the bible says that now that we're in chapter 39 you can see how how god was with him Amen. God was with him. But then the enemy, the enemy tried to attack him again. Hallelujah. Through the master's wife. I mean, her husband was rich. 
she had everything. Why would she lust over this young man? The Bible said that Joseph was handsome. I'm sure he was handsome and macho. Maybe he had like six packs or nine packs. I don't know. Amen. Praise the Lord. That's just my version. I haven't heard, so somebody shouldn't go and say, hey, theologically that is wrong. So maybe he had six packs or nine packs and he was very handsome. Hallelujah. And then the Bible said that she, because she put pressure on him, um, Joseph did not, um, he did not cave. He did not cave in. He did not, um, you know, allow all of the things, all the advances that she made toward him to to cause him to sin against his god hallelujah praise the lord and then the bible said that she had to formulate something she had to lie she had to come up with all these stories that you know um joseph joseph wanted to um um you know uh, force himself on her and all of this and this is what happens when certain people can't get through to you or your family because they can't they can't fathom what is going on so they will come up with stories they will come up with something to to tarnish your reputation they will come up with and these are the people that we call character assassinators they will they will assassinate your character they will they will say all manner of things about you hallelujah they will say things that are not true the bible said when you read verse 8 of of chapter 39 the bible said that um, but he refused and said to his master's wife look my master does not know what is with me in the house and he has committed all that he has uh, to my hand there is no one greater in this house than i this is joseph who, hey, hey, nor has he kept back anything from me but you because you are his wife how then can I do this great wickedness and sin against God? Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. And so it was as, as she spoke to Joseph day by day that he did not heed her to lie with her or to be with her. Amen. So he refused to commit that sin. Hallelujah. Mrs. Potiphar increased the pressure as she lusted on him and how she desired to have sex with him. Joseph was very handsome, as I said, hallelujah. I believe that it was a setup from the pits of hell, amen? You see, Satan does not like anything, anything good in the lives of God's children. So he will formulate anything to want to tarnish your reputation, amen? Joseph was put in charge by his master. He found favor because God was with him. Hallelujah. He was in charge of everything in the house. Amen. Amen. So you can see that she still did not give up. She kept, she kept on. She kept trying to put pressure on him. And Joseph said, how can I do this? How can I, how can I do such a wicked thing? How can I do this? I can't do this. Amen. And then she formulated, she cried out. I'm sure she said, Hey, whoa, hey, me, whoa. this man, oh. everybody come and see. This evil boy has come to mock us. That's what the Bible says when you read verse 13 and 14. And it goes on in verse 16. Amen. She lifted up her voice and cried out that he left his garment with me and fled outside. Amen. So when the master heard, verse 19, when the master heard, the master was, was upset. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. You can see that this cry was a cry of destruction. This cry was a cry of, 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 uh, um, you know, punishment because I believe, I believe that's my, that's my take on it. I believe that Joseph had integrity. Amen. Joseph had integrity. Hallelujah. He had integrity. He was loyal. Hallelujah. And because she because she pressured him and he refused she did what she did and then the bible said that that um in verse 21 but then the lord was with joseph 
and showed him mercy. Amen. And gave him favor in the sight of the keeper of the prison because they put him in prison. Amen. So you can see here as well that each time when after, after his brother sold him and the Ishmaelites then also sold him to the Egyptian, eh, which is the God of, of Pharaoh, hallelujah, God was with him. So in a way, he was being trained for his, his promotion. Amen. Sometimes we go through certain things. It's after, you know, we've been through that challenge. Then we begin to reflect and say, aha, oh, wow, this was what God meant. That's why I went through X, Y, Z. And that's why we must trust in God. No matter what it is we're going through, even when the devil is pushing us to the wall and he pins us to the wall and tries to throw a javelin into and pierce our hearts we must we must cry out to god for god to strengthen us and see us through hallelujah and see us through that test amen god was with him through this test hallelujah we're gonna start praying and tonight we are praying by the grace of god if i come your way again we will look at the next stage of joseph's life hallelujah because even when he was in the prison the bible says in verse 22 that the keeper of the prison committed to joseph's hand all the prisoners who were in the prison whatever they did there it was his doing the keeper of the prison did not look into anything that was under joseph's authority because the lord was with him and whatever he did the lord made it prosper baby. This guy was favored though. And I'm sure some of you, some of you can relate. Amen. You can relate. Hallelujah. People of God, don't forget. Amen. God favored him. God favored him. Gave him a destiny helper. The first time, which, which I shared with you yesterday in the form of Reuben. Amen. When Reuben said to the brothers, no, 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 no. You guys are saying, let us kill him and let us see what will become of his dream. Reuben intervened. Amen. So they didn't kill him. And when he was sold as slave to Potiphar, God showed him favor again. And he was in charge of the whole house. Hallelujah. And even when he ended up in the prison, after Mr. Potiphar put him in there, God was still with him. And tonight, we're going to pray. We're going to pray against character assassinators. We're going to pray that anything that breeds envy or jealousy, and you have a pure heart. You have a pure heart. Hallelujah. You have a pure heart. God will fight for you. Character assassinators, wherever they are, whether they're enemies, household enemies, wherever they are, that God will fight your battles. That no matter how they want to assassinate your character, they want to deform your character, they want to say things that are not true. God who sees in secret, God who sees the heart of every man, hallelujah, will fight for you. Amen. So tonight I want to encourage you. Do not be discouraged. The way God did it for Joseph. Joseph had integrity. Beloved, have integrity. Have a loyal heart. Depend on God. As you depend on God and you trust in God, he will, he will fight your battles for you. Hallelujah. So even though Mrs. Potiphar cooked up all those lies against Joseph, God showed him favor. Eh? God showed him favor and he was in charge. He was in charge of the prisoners. Hallelujah. So every step of the way, God was preparing him for his next glory, for his next uh, um, position in life. God is preparing you. God is preparing you. Maybe people have said something against you at your the university where you are studying or at college or at your place of work or your business, wherever it is, they try to set you up and your manager called you and said, Nancy, this is 
is what I heard and you try to explain and your manager said well somebody told me it wasn't true however I am saying to you this is what has been brought to my attention God will show you favor one more time so it doesn't matter where these people are coming from God will fight your battle tonight so right now let's just thank the Lord for his word Father, we thank you. We honor you. We give you praise. We give you glory. We give you all the adoration. We give you all the magnification. We thank you, oh Lord. The way you were with Joseph then, we know, Lord, you did it. And this is what we have read from your word. And because you did it, you will do it again for somebody tonight. In the mighty name of Jesus, somebody just thank the Lord. Father, we thank you. We honor you. Makorobo sike you cannot lie to me you cannot lie to me lion of judah you cannot lie to me you cannot lie to us you cannot lie to us oh lion of judah you cannot lie to us hallelujah he can't lie to us he will do it again only if you believe amen so what i want to say is that as we start praying those times where people have said all sorts of things beloved be encouraged ask the lord to strengthen your faith so that you don't throw in the towel instead run amen one thing that bishop bishop says all the time he says he says when you see temptation or you're a man you look you look at a woman once that once is enough don't look again or run <laughs> because if you look the second time you may fall into sin amen joseph had to flee he ran and even though he ran away, Mrs. Potter said all those things about him or against him. But God who sees in secret, God, God, God who, who sees in secret, God who sees in secret, hmm? or who saw in secret, favored him and showed him mercy because he was innocent hallelujah because he said how can i do this evil act how can i do this against god how can i do this against my master no 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 i believe if he had failed that test and temptation he probably wouldn't have been where he got to in the end so tonight we are praying and our prayer is that father disgrace every altar of iniquity in our lives with the blood of Jesus. Say, I rebuke any spell of witchcraft manipulation. Say, in the name of Jesus, let the altar of witchcraft manipulation within my household be roasted in the mighty name of Jesus. Somebody lift up your voice and pray. Somebody pray, you are praying, you are praying, somebody pray that God will to release his angels and disgrace every altar of iniquity over your life, that the blood of Jesus will fight for you one more time. In the mighty name of Jesus, somebody pray, you are praying. Somebody pray, you are praying. In the mighty name of Jesus, Makorobo Sike Yaka Baba Baba Baba, Remo Seka Taka Palebo Sike Yaka Baba Baba, Rema Kata Lebo Korobo Sike Yaba Baba Baba. Somebody pray, somebody pray that the Lord will release his angels, that the Lord will release legions of angels to fight for you. In the mighty name of Jesus, somebody pray. We are praying, somebody pray, somebody pray. And as I said,
said yesterday, uh, your prayers are not wasted. Uh, joining our uh, groaning or, or our other prayers in CCBC, Maleko Sikapa, they are not wasted. When you look at Acts 10, um, verse 31, um, the, the, the angel said um, to uh, Cornelius, your alms giving and your prayers have come up to God. Rekaba Sontele, baby. Rakababo. Remo Sikababa. Somebody pray. Make up ba 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 ba. You are praying. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. You are praying. Pray, 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 pray. Say, I rebuke her. I rebuke her. I rebuke her. The spell of witchcraft manipulation. I rebuke her. The spell of witchcraft manipulation. Let the altar of altar of witchcraft in my household be roasted. Any demonic manipulation. In the mighty name of Jesus, anything that represents uh, Mrs. Po uh, Mrs. Potiphar, in the name of Jesus, uh, whatever represents Mrs. Potiphar, Mrs. Potiphar, let it backfire in the name of Jesus. Uh, tonight, uh, we command uh, every altar of wickedness uh, constructed against us uh, to be destroyed uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, any character assassinators uh, in the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, somebody pray. Uh, somebody pray. You are praying. Uh, somebody pray, 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 pray. You are praying. You are praying uh, that every altar, every altar of witchcraft uh, in your household uh, will be roasted uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, that it will backfire. Anything that represents uh, Mrs. Potiphar that cooks up stories, uh, that 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 assassinates character, for you not to reach your destination, uh, for you not to complete uh, your assignment uh, on planet Earth. Ayima kurika manoko monika deka. Somebody pray. In the mighty name of Jesus, uh, let the fire of God uh, fall down and consume uh, every demonic altar, every false accusation. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Somebody pray. You are praying. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. In the mighty name of Jesus, you are praying. Lamika lozo mika duka ba reko bondo robo bobo bo reka ba 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 ba. Somebody pray. Makoto riba ka pa 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 pa. Somebody pray. In the name of Jesus, somebody pray. Makorobo sika yala ba 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 raka ba 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 ba. You are praying. You are praying that the Lord will release his angels uh, and disgrace uh, every altar of iniquity, every altar that represents Mrs. Potiphar in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, uh, that the blood of Jesus will speak for you one more time. Uh, you are praying. Uh, in the mighty name of Jesus, uh, every character assassinators, uh, Father, we pray Prayer, that it will backfire, 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 it will backfire in the name of Jesus, in the mighty name of Jesus, in the mighty name of Jesus. Somebody pray, you are praying, it will backfire. In the name of Jesus, Makoto Robo Sika Yala Baba Baba, Rekabala Ba Sokoto Raba Baba, Makoto Robo Sika Yandere Bebebebe, Remaka Palebo Sika Yala Baba Baba, Remakoto Robo Sika Yala Baba Baba, Remakoto Robo Sika Yala Baba, Raka Baba 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 Baba, Reka Papa Toro Boko Bobo, Zegebele Boko Roba Baba Baba, Reka Bara Bakoto Robo Sika Yala Baba Baba, Raka Baba 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 in the mighty name of Jesus, somebody pray, somebody pray, you are praying, somebody pray, you are doing well, intensify your prayers, don't be distracted, intensify your prayers, in the name of Jesus, somebody pray, somebody pray, somebody pray, somebody pray, 
Somebody pray, you are praying, you are praying. Somebody pray. In the name of Jesus, somebody pray. Any character assassinated in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. The Bible said that Mrs. Potter assassinated his character. So the master was angry. You see, the master too did not even take time to reflect on the character of Joseph. The Lord just laid that on my heart. It's not even part of my notes. Amen? Amen? So you can see that when the devil is cooking up things, when he's cooking up things, that even the person that trusted you so much will believe the lies because that's what the devil does. He comes to kill, to steal, and to destroy. The Bible says that Jesus has come to give life. Amen? Hallelujah. Because the master did not even ask. He did not even say, oh, my wife, I know you are my wife, and I know you are saying all these things, but this guy is not like that. He believed, and then he put him in prison. But the, most, the, the amazing testimony out of this is that God showed him mercy. And then they put him in charge over the other prisoners. My God, this is the God that we serve. And that's why, beloved, anything you do, hmm? the Bible says, Blessed are the pure at heart, for they shall see God. God, you will see God at times like that. Amen? In moments like that, hallelujah where people have cooked up things against you, God will fight for you. Hallelujah. Our next prayer, any demon, any wasters of, for, uh, of, of destinies, wasters of fortune, wasters of, 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 of divine promotion that will come and assassinate your character so that you will not get that promotion. So that even your, 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 your spouse will not believe you. Even your children will not believe you. Tonight, we want to destroy it right now. Somebody please repeat after me so that we pray a prayer of unity. Say in the name of Jesus, I destroy every curse of failure in the name of Jesus. Say, oh Lord, reveal to me every secret behind the challenges i'm going through say in the name of jesus oh lord any destiny wasters let it backfire character assassinators let it backfire in jesus name amen joseph knew that if he was he was put in that prison so let's pray that God will reveal it to you in the name of Jesus. Somebody pray. You are praying, you are praying, you are praying, you are praying. You are praying. Emilia Wilson, you are praying now. Minister Mary Annan, pray. Mama Juliet Animo, pray. First Lady Juliet Amwakwa, pray. Intensify your prayers. Emma D, intensify your prayers. Billy Jean Nelson, intensify your prayers. In the mighty name of Jesus. Pastor Lillian Njalbi, pray. In the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, Pastor Vida Golu, pray. You are praying. Ah, Minister Kennedy Marfo, pray. That nobody will be able to assassinate your character and still your hard work all your labor all these years in the name of jesus christ of nazareth in the name of jesus 
Oh, Sister Alberta, do a mess a prayer in the mighty name of Jesus. Rashada prayer in the name of Jesus. Olivia, Oliver pray in the name of Jesus. That nobody will be able to assassinate your character and go scot free in the name of Jesus. Sandra, you are praying. Oh, Sister Atwa Atta, you are praying. Pastor Samuel Harden, you are praying. In the mighty name of Jesus, Reka Paleboko Soko Payande, Elizabeth Ando, you are praying her, Mama Beatrice, you are praying her, Remoko Soko Torobo Sika, Minister Just Kalika Suka Palika Soka Pa, hey, Jackie Folks, you are praying her, in the mighty name of Jesus, somebody pray her, Mama Comfort Mesa, you are praying, in the name of Jesus, Bonsu, ah, Auntie Leticia Apoko, you are praying her, somebody pray her, Tenny and Jola, you are praying now. Ah, Sister Tio Broke, you are praying now. Erica, pray now. In the name of Jesus, somebody intensify your prayers. Uh, that anyone uh, that will represent or represents right now whatever is happening in your life, um, and you can relate uh, that there are some people who are character assassinators, uh, that God will fight your battles uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, that nobody will be able to waste your. Your destiny will not be wasted. What God has written concerning your life, your assignment will be manifested in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Somebody pray. Ade and Allah, intensify your prayers. Makonde libo korobo sika yanderebe. Rakabababa anti philomena, you are praying. Somebody pray. Oh, Kapalis, Tani and John, Ayama Sekebe Yande, Sister Sarah Kakimbo pray oh evil the house pray in the name of jesus somebody pray you are praying in the mighty name of Jesus, let my kotorobo sika baba intensify your prayers. Intensify your prayers. Intensify your prayers. God is doing it right now. God has released his angels. He is chasing away your character, every character assassinators that the enemy has employed. Ah, Mama Julia Nanimo pray. Mama Loretta Lewis, you are praying in the mighty name of Jesus. They are running away right now. Somebody pray, somebody pray, somebody pray, somebody pray, somebody pray, somebody pray in the name of Jesus. Romo kapalibo sike bebebe, remo koto lobo sika yaka bababa, rebo sika yandele bebebebe, remo koto lobo sika yaka bababa, remo koto lobo sika yaka bababa, rebo sika yaka bababa, baba baba, robo kosho to robo sika yandele bebebebe, remo kapa yandele bo koto robo sika yala baba. Bye-bye. In the name of Jesus, somebody pray. Remako seke beli moko ba 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 ba. Remako toro bo kapa pa pa pa. La kapa chis kapa tos kapa lis kavos. Vali kadus kavale dus kavale dus ka. Li kaboni kasko vonde li kaba. Remakuta kapa li kasunde rebe bebe. Pastor Gladys and Apostle Smith pray. In the mighty name of Jesus, na nefwa you are praying. Oh, mama, mama. Makatuli baka, Clarice, you are praying now. Raka pali kosi kabala basunde lebe lebe lebe. Somebody pray him. Somebody pray him. Somebody pray him. Intensify your prayers. Intensify your prayers. MAD, intensify your prayers. The character assassinators will be put to shame. They will be put to shame in the name of Jesus. They will be put to shame. They will be put to shame. Pastor Samuel Harden pray him. In the name of Jesus, ah, as they gather to Mahali Mokobali and the Rebbe, Ayikabo Rebbe, 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 it will not stand. 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 In Jesus' name, Amen. Korobosi kaba ba 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 ba. The name of Jesus. Kibele bo kuro bo bebe Kondeli ba kabali bo sukoro bo sika ya ba 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 ba. In Jesus' mighty name, Amen and Amen and Amen and Amen and Amen. 
We give God the glory. We give him all the praise in the name of Jesus. As I agree with you, Mahandele Moko Paris Kabora Mashandara Bakora Basi and Ayika Luz Kabandele Bo Kabali and Derebi. I want you to connect with me as we as we connect um, or oh, and tap into the oil of our Papa Bishop Francis Saponga and our prophets, Prophet Stephen Mensa, oh Mahandele Boko, Prophet Albert. Marika Sundara Baba Reverend James and all the men of God that comes on this platform tonight. We agree in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Right now, I mention your name before the throne of grace. Sandra, in the mighty name of Jesus, God has chased away all character assassinators concerning your life and your ministry in the mighty name of Jesus. Mama Clarice here, God has released angels fight to fight for you in the name of Jesus. Character assassinators are fleeing right now. Uncle William Bonsua, in the mighty name of Jesus. Ade and Ola, every character assassinator, Malika Zundaraba Koriba Sihande, their plans have backfired in the name of Jesus. Anti Felicia question. Hayi Faluka sis Kabondalaba. It is done only if you believe in the mighty name of Jesus. As you type Amen, so it is for you. Rakabali Moko Payande Bebebebe. Mateo Rakabasi Kebayande. It is done. Every character assassinator in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Mama Ellen Aloque. It is done for you and your household. Makura Bakora Basuka Paliska Bonda La Basuka Yanderebe Tenny and Jola, it is done in the name of Jesus. Minister Mary, Mary Anang, it is done for you. Reverend James, Ajimajua and your household, it is done in the name of Jesus. Auntie Leticia Opoku, Mama, Mama Loretta Lewis, Makopari and Mama Matabempa, Ayakura Kasunda, Lami Ket. You will make it, you will finish well. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Auntie Philomena Opoku Boaten. Malika Suka Paliskaba. Mama Teresa Echampong. It is done for you. Auntie Gabrielina. It is done for you. Amaha. It is done for you. Ah, Auntie Tio Broke. It is done for you. In the name of Jesus. Pastor Vida Golua. Mama Baliko. Sika Luka Balisa Dora Baba Mama Evelyn Karamanji, it is done for you. Sephora, you and your household are more than conquerors in the name of Jesus. Naketo, so it is at your place of work in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth it is done in the mighty name of Jesus Mama Agnes Quatten Maliku Kali Savonda Justin Peters so it is in the name of Jesus Silvette and your family Malaku Malisa Volima Kosebide Suka Damandos Kedelemos Menoka Malaku Askova Liska Vosh Lenne Suska viska ndoska vosh liska fola sante lebo si Israel, Arika Rukaska, I commit and I lift up Israel before the throne of mercy in Jesus' mighty name. Makura Kasuka Paliska Vondale Mose Aya Moka Paliska Vondele Boa. Minister Jacqueline Fox, so it is for you. Lisa Pong Opoka, Mahlaka Mando Siki Biskandorika. Eric Amwako, it is done for you. Rikapa Erika, it is done for you in Jesus mighty name. First Lady Juliette Amwakwan. So it is MRD. It is done. It is settled. Forever oh God. Forever oh God. His word is settled in heaven concerning your lives tonight in Jesus Mighty name, Rima Suka Palande, Auntie Lydia Makaboro Bosika Yande. It is done for you in Jesus mighty name. Amen and amen and amen. Hallelujah. As you believe tonight, the word of God came. You can read it in your own time. Genesis 
37 and 39. God willing, we will look at chapter 40 when we meet again and look at the journey of Joseph. Yesterday, I said that God raised up a destiny helper in form of his older brother. Hallelujah. He wasn't killed. He was sold. And now, when he was in Potiphar's house, Mrs. Potiphar assassinated his character, lied against him, and he was put in the prison. Even in the prison, God showed him favor. And he was the one that they put in charge over the other prisoners. Hallelujah. So whatever it is that was planned tonight, God has given you victory in the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Evangelists, it is done. All slanderers are are quite they, 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 they. God has chased them away from you in Jesus mighty name father we thank you we honor you we give you praise we give you glory we give you all the adoration in Jesus mighty name amen and amen and amen and amen so this is how far God has brought us God bless you we will meet you online 2 a.m. You will hear prophet's voice 2 a.m. Please join us. Your life will not be the same. Amen. It's going to be hot prayers 2 a.m. After we share the grace, you will see the um, prophet's number there. You can message him and the link will be sent to you in the name of Jesus. And tomorrow night, Prophet Albert will come your way in Jesus' name. Ade and Ola, you are more than conquerors. Prophet Nana Yao Boaten, victory is yours in Jesus' mighty name. Amen and amen. Please let's share the grace. Jola, you are victorious in Jesus' name. Amen. Whew. Father, we thank you. Auntie Efua Epperson, you and your household are free from character assassinators in Jesus' name. Amen. Oliver, you are victorious in Jesus' name. Amen. So please let's share the grace. Um, Calvary Broadcast, you are victorious. Prophet Stephen Mensah, God bless you in Jesus' name. Amen and amen and amen. Please let's share the grace. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives, and we will dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Close up with Dr. Asamwa. You are victorious. No character assassinators will come near your practice. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen and amen and amen. God bless you. I love you with the love of the Lord. Amen. Bye-bye, yo. Bye. Amen. God bless you. Amen to all your prayers. I receive them in Jesus' mighty name. Bye.